Would you live in this house? This is no ordinary dwelling. Standing tall on Franklin Avenue at the foot of Los Feliz foothills is a unique Mayan revival home. The brainchild of Frank Lloyd Wright Jr., this architectural marvel draws inspiration from the intimidating yet captivating entrances of ancient caves and tombs. Constructed in the Roaring Twenties, it was a haven for Hollywood's bohemian parties. But beyond its block-style facade lies a darker narrative tied to America's most infamous cold case, the Black Dahlia. But this house holds more than just architectural secrets, it's shrouded in a chilling mystery. In the Roaring Twenties, this house was the scene of extravagant Hollywood parties. Steeped in glamour and mystique, the Mayan Revival-style home became a beacon of the bohemian lifestyle. The house was built in 1926 for photographer John Soudan, who filled the home with a young family and an air of artistic exuberance. The block-style facade, reminiscent of an ancient tomb or a cave's menacing entrance, became a familiar sight for Hollywood's in-crowd. The home's walls echoed with the laughter and chatter of starlets and dreamers as they reveled in its unique charm. Then in 1945, the narrative of the house took a dramatic turn with the arrival of new resident, Dr. George Hodel. The renowned physician brought with him an aura of intrigue that would forever mark the house's history. Little did anyone know, the house that had played host to glamorous parties would soon be enveloped in a cloud of mystery and suspicion. But the merry times were about to take a sinister turn. In 1950, the house's owner, Dr. George Hodel, became a prime suspect in the chilling Black Dahlia case. The case, still one of America's most infamous unsolved mysteries, centers around Elizabeth Short, a young woman with Hollywood dreams and a tragic end. Her severed body was discovered in a Los Angeles lot, her death shrouded in a gruesome mystery that would captivate the nation. Dr. Hodel, a prominent physician, moved into the Soudan house in 1945, and it wasn't long before whispers of his connection to the Black Dahlia began to circulate. His own son Steve, an ex-LAPD detective, even published a book claiming his father was the murderer. His allegations were based on a series of haunting photographs found in his father's possession, one of which bore a striking resemblance to Elizabeth Short. While the physical evidence linking Dr. Hodel to the crime is circumstantial at best, there are those in the true crime community who believe that the murder took place within the walls of the Soudan house. They point to its secluded location, the labyrinthine layout, and Dr. Hodel's reputation for hosting extravagant parties as the perfect backdrop for such a heinous act. Despite the lack of concrete evidence, the speculation around Dr. Hodel's involvement has forever intertwined the fate of the Soudan house with the tragic tale of the Black Dahlia. The unsolved mystery of the Black Dahlia has forever cast a shadow over this house. As the years passed, the house fell into disrepair, becoming a haunting figure in the Los Feliz neighborhood. Its once lively walls grew silent, and the grandeur of the mansion was replaced by an eerie desolation. Abandoned for lengthy periods in the late 20th century, the house's peculiar aura intrigued and unsettled passers-by. Former occupant and retired LAPD investigator Steve Hodel recounted tales of its haunting presence. He spoke of the housekeeper's return in the 1970s, who upon seeing the house again, declared it a house of evil. Others echoed her sentiments, with many pointing to the house and whispering, it's an evil place, murders happened there. The basement in particular held a chilling secret. Dr. Hodel's daughter Tamar, and later his granddaughter Fauna, both claimed to have seen the spirit of a young woman lurking in its shadows. Their separate encounters, years apart, added to the house's haunting reputation. Whether it's architecture, history, or a haunting you're after, the Soudan house offers it all. So, still fancy living in this house? From its early days as a hub for Hollywood's bohemian parties, this Mayan revival home has certainly seen its fair share of history. Designed by Frank Lloyd Wright Jr., it first served as a home to photographer John Soudan and his family, before becoming the residence of Dr. George Hodel, a prime suspect in the unsolved Black Dahlia case. This house, with its block-style facade inspired by the mysterious allure of a cave or an ancient tomb, has not only been a silent witness to the joys and sorrows of its inhabitants, but also to the chilling whispers of a notorious cold case. Its haunting reputation, fueled by tales of ghostly apparitions and eerie vibes, has added another layer to its already complex narrative. Thanks for joining us on this chilling journey. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out other content for more haunting tales.